about. Instead of being a tourist, I should be focusing on buying one of those. Derecha. Man, uh, this city is so pretty. <laughs> oh gosh, I don't know why I never... Hola amigos y viva Mexico way! Today, this is my first day in this city. I'm super excited. <laughs> Maybe you can notice it from my face. I didn't have breakfast. I'm not expecting to have breakfast. I checked it in my room, but it was a bit too expensive. Five dollars. It's a bit too much. <laughs> also, I'm supposed to lose many, many, many kilos during this trip. And I have no idea how long I'm gonna be in Mexico. It could be three or six months even. <laughs> Being my first day, I need to understand the city a bit. For example, there is no green light for pedestrians, but just the red light for the cars. Which means I can actually pass. And here there is something which I love. Bikes, lots of bikes for us uh, citizens. Uh, well, I'm not a citizen, but who knows? Maybe I would marry a Mexican girl. Regarding girls, I've been passing some time on Tinder. Mm-hmm. Oh. Um, okay. It wasn't the plan. The only way I use Tinder is to get to know locals, not to bring girls to bed. But yeah, there is enough space. My voice is not perfect today, but uh, thank God you can still enjoy the video through watching the video, not just by hearing me. <laughs> thank you. Being my first day, I needed to run some errands. And yes, I've been passing with the red light because that's what everyone is doing and there is the police there the police has a very very cool car i really fear it for the criminals over here but okay <laughs> this one is the metro station near my house by house i do mean a hotel i think i'm gonna stay in a hotel for the first day understand which district i like the most and then i'm gonna move in uh, into an airbnb probably i don't know let's see Hola. I feel like uh, it's 10.30 a.m. and the shops are about to open. So I need to try to get to the city center. Then I need to find an adapter for my EU adapter because I need to edit these videos and I have no way to do it uh, without electricity. This shaver was about to abandon me half the way through the cutting. You see guys, the shops are opening just now. So maybe from 9 until 11 I should be editing and then go out to conquer the streets. <laughs> there is lots of security everywhere, especially near the Mercados. And uh, well, I feel safe. So para el centro histórico, I think we need to turn right. Or maybe go back on uh, Zapateria Las Vegas. By the way, it is very, very hard to see unless uh, you are on a super high building, but uh, Mexico City is uh, surrounded by mountains. I didn't expect that, but I knew that the city is pretty high, like 2,000 meters above uh, the sea level. No worries, guys, we are going to enjoy lots of street food in uh, future videos. Maybe something also today. El Sol de Mexico. The mejor, uh, I don't know, newspaper. I really, really need to learn how to tomar a bike. Near every mercado, there is uh, police protecting it. And uh, they are just opening. <laughs> wow, life starts maybe at 12. I don't know. I might have found a very nice pedestrian street. Looks like a church almost, but I don't know. Ah, Iglesia Metodista. It is a church. I'm putting the mask on. Let's check what it looks like. So the situation was a bit <laughs> funny because at first he was ignoring me. Then I think he, he felt guilty and he was like, do I stand up or do I not stand up? And when he stood up... <laughs> it's close. Uh, can visit or oh, it's yeah, yeah. At this point, I was just laughing in my head. He seemed very, very unsure if I could visit the church or not. Ah. <laughs> uh. oh. Okay, no, no. Gracias. 
I'm um, not interested in registering myself on any paper book nowadays because you never know, maybe somebody has corona inside and then you get stuck in quarantine somewhere. Don't register yourself. Oh. Okay, I think we might have gotten to the main street uh, here in downtown. Very, very nice building. Guys, you can see that Halloween is approaching. Check also her bag, but mostly these masks. Also, my hotel is totally decorated for Halloween, so maybe it's an important festivity here. Please, dear Mexicans, perdóname. I didn't know about El Día de los Muertos. This is la mia primera volta in questa nación. Perdóname, perdóname, perdóname. Well, uh, the city looks very, very nice. I have no idea where those tourists are going. Maybe it's a church, so let's try to get inside this one. Maybe it's not a church, it's just a temple. But look, it's like a castle. <laughs> Maybe there was a river full of crocodiles to get inside. Maybe I'll come back here to make some photos for my very, very Christian mother. 10.59, this place is opening, <laughs> so now we know. Life starts at 11 a.m. Instead of being a tourist, I should be focusing on buying one of those. But it is more fun this way, and look where we have gotten, to the Constitution Square. And there is an amazing, amazing building over there. Can you believe me that I have done zero research before coming to Mexico? And... Uh, Everything I see is for the first time. I didn't see even any photo. <laughs> I'm a mess. Look, I'm learning from the locals uh, to pass with the red light, okay? If they do it, I can. <laughs> I hope. The Mexican flag, which you cannot see, resembles so much the Italian flag. And uh, look on the other way. Incredible, incredible place. I don't know if I should be saying look on the other way or look to the other way. Feel free to correct my English in the comments. Thank you. But okay. So I was about to upload something on Instagram and TikTok. Please follow me also there. <laughs> and suddenly the internet is finished. I knew the guy that sold me the sinker was doing kind of a scam. It worked out for a day. Now I need to find a proper shop. <laughs> I wish I had filmed that interaction. I have no idea if this thing is happening every Sunday. But it's pretty interesting. Today we got only one mission, this thing. El nombre Miguel has much appreciated. It's my name. So I am an idiot. I didn't realize until I said it. It's Sunday. Probably that's the reason that all these shops are closed. I love that on Sunday everyone is on the streets. This thing is not happening in the north of Europe in general. I missed it so much. Wow. So market on this side and food on this other side. Gracias. Is it a Maradona or is it a Mexican lady? <laughs> Reminds me too much of the Argentinian shirt. Interesting scene. They were white, but I don't know if they are Mexican. <laughs> the jet lag is hitting me. Gosh. I'm totally falling asleep. And I didn't buy any adapter. I didn't get food. And I think I need to fix my sinker too. It's a huge mess. We'll see. <laughs> a nobleman, a blue blood person probably. Or a conquistador, I don't know. Who are you? I need to take something. 
ingredients like the dough for the nachos. We need to get also tacos de carnitas. Jesus, everything will fall from the plate. My first original taco. Okay. That's something different. By now I'm totally, totally sleep walking. I don't know why, but every shop in this corner is a pharmacy. An adapter, adaptator. Dove puoi comprare un adaptator? Oh. Ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> Voy a todo es cerrado. Eh. <laughs> ¿Qué Pino Suárez? Sí. True address. Ok. Eh. Oh, wait. Pino Suárez. Eh, sí. y, y, ¿Izquierda o derecha? Derecha. Derecha. Ok. 200. Sí. Ok. Es que no sé si aquí es la ¿Cómo se llama la plaza? Quería tres cuadras, ¿no? Esa sangre, ¿no? Esa tres cuadras, ¿no? Según yo. Y esa sería. Ajá. Ok, so aquí y derecha. No. A tres izquierda. Calles. Ok. Tres. A la derecha. Tres, tres a la derecha. Gracias. Sí, que le ven. Buenos días. Isha Saga. Isha Saga. We did arrive at Isha Saga, the street they were suggesting, but uh, also over here, everything seems closed. We are searching for this guy, if you have seen him, contact, I don't know, what's written here. I have no idea if it's a funeral or it's a party thing. I do think it's religious. Excuse me, do you know a shop of electronics? Okay, thank you. It said the negozio in Italian, but it's a tienda in Spanish. Tengono aquí una tienda de electrónica para un adaptador. Aquí todo derecho. Okay, gracias. Let's see, guys. Maybe we're getting lucky because I really need to edit to these videos. Hola. Tienes un adapt adaptador? Adaptador? No. ¿Dónde es posible comprar? Piso 4 4? 1, 2, 3, 4 Ah, ah, ok, gracias Para el piso 4? Ahora de este lado ¿Aquí? Sí Ok Hola ¿Tienes un adaptador? We found the adapter in this shop It was 160 Mexican dollars I don't know if it's a fair price or not, but uh, we need it because without publishing videos we don't make money. Well, I think that's it for this video. Thank you so much to Tyrant's Kitchen for buying me these shoes. If you would like to support my trips, check out the link in the description for Patreon and PayPal. Thank you so much for watching, keep reading and believing in dreams. Ciao! Gracias Mexico! <laughs>